Hi, welcome all of you on platform of your PD education and uh, this particular video is related to uh, the small strategy different strategy which we can uh, uh, make for uh, these exams those of you who are writing gate exam also and engineering services exam also if you're writing both exams you should know that uh, preliminary of engineering services and gate exam are going to come in feb itself so uh, I, this has not happened earlier actually because there used to be difference in gate exam and uh, engineering services i think this is the first time which is happening like that what how the strategy can be made for that you know engineering services preliminary is uh, technical and non-technical this paper one paper two and gate is totally technical so uh, the strategy what you can think of is like uh, uh, for gate it is all you have to make a technical preparation so engineering services ka jo paper one hai, that is the paper one of engineering services which is basically a non-technical paper that preparation of that paper is not going to help you in uh, your exam of a gate exam but paper two jo hoga engineering services ka for paper two of engineering services that is technical paper so this technical paper is going to help you in uh, you know your gate exam also because you know syllabus technical syllabus can help you somewhere in and nowadays gate exam since it is online exam it is coming similar to your inning services preliminary paper so uh, this paper two of inning services preliminary somewhere is going to help you in gate also but paper one is not going to help you at all now the strategy can be like you need to fix up some time slot for paper one of engineering services and in my opinion it is now you know october month is going on november december january february so these couple of months are left i think if two hours you give to paper one two hours you give to paper one of engineering services every day till your exam and just before gate exam and preliminary let's say 10 15 days before uh, you reduce that particular hours uh, two hours to one hour and increase the time for technical that can be the best strategy because this paper is not formula oriented paper it is a concept uh, knowledge oriented and common sense development related uh, phenomena like values and ethics project management you need to have some kind of uh, you know understanding of the concept so as of now start devoting two hours per day and just before the exam some 10 15 days before the exam you reduce this two hours to one hours and give more emphasis to the technical paper so as of now start preparing for non-technical and thereafter focus should be more on technical that is the only way i think we can make a balance between the two papers engineering services and gate both and i tell you one more thing i told you earlier also in the uh, in the uh, videos that students have lost motivation for engineering services after railways have come out of it and uh, competition has increased because of reduction in the number of seats competition has decreased because less people are going for this exam now so if you add these two factors then there is an opportunity for you to get into that maybe that is optimism on my part but that is true whenever i interact with the students they are not very motivated for this exam so if you want to go for engineering services i'm not saying whether you go or not i'm saying if you want to go for engineering services you have filled the form then be motivated and prepare well for this uh, this particular exam and opportunity is always there probability is always there for selection i remember that when number of seats in civil services ias exam used to be very high and when number of seats are reduced to great extent i mean at one point of time they used to be more than 100 ias seats and at one point of time they became less than 30 also the competition was almost the same it is not that when it is 30 competition is huge actually it does not happen that way competition remains same. i don't know the reason but competition remains same maybe many students get demotivated leave the race and le less are left in the race that is how it goes i don't know the reason but yes the people who get into that are the people who do not make much analysis but give their best they keep on preparing now for paper one you can always depend upon uh, the very good material made by your pd education you can take that paper and we are updating that uh, syllabus of as per the last year paper we are updating some of the content of paper one but already it is made very good content very good test series you can utilize that and you can prepare really well for engineering services so this is the strategy and i will make some kind of videos on updated topics for your benefit so all the very best and keep preparing for this exam thank you